it was a Friday evening. Greg was done with work and we took the Yegos to Kigali Carrento. We wanted to rent a car for our upcoming trip. And yeah, car owners. Anyway. Yeah, the Kigali car rental had very good prices and yeah, we really hope to enjoy this ride because it's gonna be a long one. So that evening passed by real fast and at night we headed to town to a hotel de Mikoli because we had a friend to meet there and we had the Friday evenings were the best. They have traditional dances and traditional music. Yeah, and we really wanted to enjoy that before we hit the road for a very, very long time. You see this place, the services were a 10 out of 10. The food was good, the drinks were good, the services, the music, like, very very fantastic and our friend mommy joined and boom the entertainment began <laughs>
So we checked out of our beautiful, beautiful apartment and we're ready for a road trip. For anybody who was asking, we're staying at the Le Royale apartment. Very beautiful, very cozy. Uh, you can find them on Google Maps and contact them. And boom, road trip time. a lot of road footage with views and my driver who was driving for the first time in africa just so cool There we were on our first destination for a week's road trip in Mosanze. It's another big city in the north of Rwanda and we were ready to explore. We had reached our place we were staying at fravan and it's an eco resort so we we're just going to enjoy staying in nature Welcome to our home for the next few days. We have um, that place, which I don't know. Uh, we have this other place, which yeah, I think separates our rooms. Then we have a big veranda where I Can think feel. the bags will be. And this is our room. It's a small room in nature. Come in, baby. Um, the towels and stuff, the bed, a small window here somewhere. It's quite small. Then you can show them the bed, the big bed. This is where we sleep and stuff. And this is our bathroom portable, bath, shower, toilet, a basic bathroom, whatever you need. In watch. nature. We can watch the birdies if we're lucky. Why not? Why not? Yeah, so <laughs> welcome to our court. So the Favani has a campsite, it has a garden, it has a bar and restaurant and other public toilets. And that night there was supposed to be like a party, so th that's why the the garden is being decorated. But we we're okay with anything because we really wanted to enjoy that stay there. This was the restaurant and the bar place. There is a fireplace because it's very cold in Musanze and also being in nature makes it super cold. 
and that was the beginning of the party in the evening we decided to take a tour before leaving and that's where we ended up ordering our dinner so as you can see it was the hiking day we got up really early to have morning breakfast and hit the road hi guys so hiking at Mount Pisoke hopefully hopefully because it woke we woke up when it was raining so yeah come with us bye So to get a permit to hike Mount Bisoke, Mount Karisimbi and also to see the gorillas, you have to head to the Volcanoes National Park headquarters and also to be briefed. So that's why there is a lot of people here but almost everyone is going to a different location. So right there we were driving to a certain point because you have to drive to a certain point before you start the hike and we had our tour guide with us and that really felt like an African massage. So just looking at that mountain it looked so high and so steep but there is an alternative way and that is the one that we were taking for the hike all of us. So our hike started and hey, I was so excited. <laughs> I literally thought it's just as simple as And at the very beginning of our hike, we got lucky to spot the mountain gorillas. Oh my god, look at that. just know that that was a very magical moment a very special moment and people pay a hundred a thousand dollars to go see these up close but even seeing them from afar you see the beauty of nature in them you just see the beauty in them and yeah At this point, we had been going for over two hours, maybe, maybe even three, I don't know. And it was so muddy because of the rain and it was so slippery, but we keep going, we kept going. At this point, we had we in the middle of nowhere, there was nobody in front of us, nobody behind us. <laughs> we just felt like uh, the, the porter just take us and <laughs> we didn't know where we were going, that's all. But it was a tricky hike, <laughs> very, very tricky. At a certain point, uh, we just felt like this was not hiking anymore. This was mountaineering. <laughs> like this is what mountaineers do. 
and I was already tired, very, very tired. Okay, Fortune, you're doing great. We're almost at the summit. You're fighting a lot, we're fighting a lot. We're gonna be there, and everybody's so proud of you. Okay. So, we made it on top of 3711. <laughs> Not one meter less than that. <laughs> did we almost give up? Yeah. We did, but. Respect us. <laughs> yeah, please do. Please do. Though it was so misty and probably very cold, we are really glad that we made it up here and we are really proud of ourselves. <laughs> oh. Maybe we made it? We have made it and there's a, a mist, thunder, and, and volcanic. Hands up! Uh, uh, noises going on. No, I'm kidding. It's warm <laughs> and it's sad. It's a bit misty. Welcome to Rwanda. <laughs> and we still got a glimpse of the Bisoke crater before the mist took over again. We have done hiking before but always the way up was different from the way down but for this one the same way up was the same way down and it was so slippery like ah! So this was like the most interesting part for me i was literally the last person up and i was the first person down and i was happy i was very proud of myself and all the others came after which was okay but i don't know i was just proud of myself how do you feel man it's very easy so on the way down we were also lucky to see the bush bugs i'd never seen bush bugs so i was so happy and the hiking today heading back to the hotel and finding something to do very tired but it was good so yeah thank you guys for watching please don't forget to subscribe and like bye